So, you want to be a Ghostbuster? There's a new mobile game for iOS and Android called Ghostbusters World. It puts you on a quest to catch ghosts around your neighborhood. Oh sure, you've played Pokemon Go before, but this adds a new dimension to the concept. You think you got what it takes to bust some augmented reality apparitions? Do you know your proton pack from a PKE meter? Do you know a particle thrower from a boson caster? Your ectoplasm from an ecto cooler? Well, before you suit up, Listen up! Here are five tips to becoming a Ghostbusters, Ghostbusters World Game Master! You know, seeing ghosts in the real world with augmented reality is really great, but AR uses a lot of battery life. So if you're gonna go exploring supernatural phenomenon in your neighborhood, bring a battery pack. Ghostbusters game uses AR, which will chew up a little bit more of your battery life. Now if you want to save on your battery, you can turn off AR. Now, that might not be as fun, but you'll probably last a little bit longer out there. Some of these ghosts get pretty feisty in a fight. That makes battles a two-hand job. One finger will be holding down your particle thrower beam, while the other needs to be ready to tap the right spot to counter the ghost attack. You'll also need to hit a button to throw the trap when ready. And once you've restrained a ghost in your capture stream, you can raise them off the ground to see the slam button appear. Press it in time, and you'll get them nice and woozy for a few seconds. When it's stunned, it's easier to contain the ghost over a trap. Battles can get pretty involved. This ain't your grandmother's Pokemon Go. All right, this chick is toast. Back off, man. I'm a scientist. There's a tutorial mode, but it's a doozy. It could take up to an hour, but don't worry, you can skip that, go back to the health section, and find out what you missed. But if you skip it, you can miss some bonuses, so just buckle up and enjoy the guided ride. And then there's turn-based fighting that also eats up some time that takes place in the ghost dimension. That's right, ghost dimension battles, because normal weapons don't work in the ghost dimension, so you need to have your captured ghosts fight for you in these team battles, which is a whole other layer to the game. Generally, you don't see that kind of behavior in a major appliance. If you're feeling impatient, you could set your ghost to auto-fight in a battle. And there are elemental matchups in battle, so a fire ghost would do more damage to an earth ghost, and water would do more damage to fire. There's a whole system to learn. And wait until you get to hatch ectospheres in Cyto converters. Can we just call them ghost eggs? I mean, clearly this is Pokemon Go, right? To get ahead, you'll have to do tasks to upgrade your weapons and your ghosts. You need the tools and the talent to find power-ups. First off, in the map, there are dimensional doors that offer power-ups, but those are based on points of interest from Google. If you don't live in a busy urban area, you can make your own remote gate and set it up near your home or school or work to collect rewards frequently. You can't move the gate once you install it, so don't screw it up. Battles will level up your captured ghosts, but you can also give them a boost with PKE crystals. And if you've already captured a ghost, or if you've run out of traps, you can also get some crystals by destabilizing ghosts instead of trapping them. So you can just blast them out of this plane of existence. You'll also need to research equipment upgrades. You'll need more than your standard blaster. You know, it just occurred to me we haven't had a completely successful test of this equipment. I blame myself. So do I. There are more than 150 ghosts. They're from both the old and new movies, as well as the animated series and the comic books. Reference books like Tobin's Spirit Guide are also in the app, which clues you into the history and lore. If you've busted all the ghosts in your area, don't worry. You can use the ghost tracker to find more. Or use ecto goggles. 
Overall, this is more involved than Pokemon. It's more skill-based, but if you're a Ghostbusters fan, you'll have some fun. We came. We saw. We, we kicked, kicked it out. Okay. Ghostbusters.